iPhone screenshot hack, capture screens with a back tap. Do you want to have something like this when you double tap the back <laughs> to take screenshots? To enable this, go to setting, then accessibility, this page, tab on touch. And at the bottom, there is a menu called back tab. Click on it, and uh, you can choose double tab or triple tab. I've selected double tab, and in this page, select screenshots. And this will make the iPhone, when you double tap at the back, it will take screenshots. <laughs> Thanks for watching. How to reset iPhone fast? How to reset your iPhone? First go to setting, then tap on general, scroll down and tap on transfer or reset iPhone. In this page you have two options, the first one is reset and the second is to erase all content and setting. What will you do with reset is, you can reset the settings, the layout, the privacy, something like that. It will not reset your uh, total form. To erase all content and reset everything, you need to tap on erase all contents and setting. In this page, for example, I will may lose this up and that apps and data 15 gb of data if you tab on continue it will start resetting if one will restart two times it, it will take up to five minutes to reset everything and everything will be reset and you'll have your new brand new factor resetted iphone and in this step it will ask you for your apple id passwords and if it's ID passwords, everything will be asked if you insert everything correctly. Everything will be resetted. Uh, currently, I don't want to reset my iPhone, so I will click on not now. I hope this helps us. Thanks for watching. How to change wallpaper on iPhone? How to change your iPhone's wallpaper? Got setting. Then find and tab on wallpaper. Our new wallpaper. In this page, there are a lot of wallpapers you can choose from. Um, let's make it this time astronomy. Here is a move. Mars. Chipser. Saturn. Uranus. So let's fix it. Tab on add. You can choose set as one per pair or customize. Let's customize it. So the inner part is the axis. You can change the color. You can choose gradient. Or you can choose photos and you can Upload your photos to your wallpaper. I think the pair is fine. So done. Oh, it looks good. Thanks for watching. <laughs> How to clear your iPhone browsing history in seconds? How to clear your browsing history from your iPhone. Uh, first go to setting, then tab on Safari, which is your browser, then scroll down, and tab on clear history and website that. It will ask you for confirmation. And you can, if you do have multiple tabs, you can close all some and then tab on clear history. That's it. Thanks for watching. How to view Wi-Fi passwords on iPhone. 
how to view Wi-Fi password on your iPhone. First, go to setting, then tap on the Wi-Fi, which is connected right now. Here is a Wi-Fi, and I want to see the password of this Wi-Fi. Tap on this eye icon, info, info icon, and as you can see, here is a password. Just tap on it. Here is a password. <laughs> Thanks for watching. How to show battery percentage on iPhone. How to display battery remaining percentage in iPhone. Tap on setting. Then go to battery. Then toggle this battery percentage like, as you can see so remaining battery percentage is, is shown or displayed in the battery section this is how we do it thanks for watching how to recover deleted photos on iPhone how to recover recently deleted uh, photos in iPhone for example if you delete a picture and uh, if you want to recover it uh, or if you delete a picture accidentally like this and uh, if you want to recover this picture what you have to do is go to albums then scroll down and get recently deleted i have two photos which both are left with 29 days after this 29 days this picture should be permanently deleted but before the end of these days if I want to recover them I will tap on them and at the bottom there is permanently delete and recover options you can tap on recover and uh, confirm recover photo then as you can see the photo is recovered this one is the second picture if you remember there were two photos and uh, the one that I recovered is removed from this recently deleted pictures folder. Thanks for watching. How to view iPhones? Am I using secret code and dialer instantly? How to check email number of your iPhone? First, go to your dialer. Then, uh, dial this number: star hash zero six. Then finally, hash again. As you can see, the email number and the other device information will be popped. Thanks for watching. How to reset iPhone to factory settings in minutes? How to turn home screen layout to factory default? As you can see, there are three tabs, and uh, or the, this is not the way that that the factory default is. So let's go to setting, then general, then tap on transfer or reset iPhone. Then tap on reset. Select Reset Home Screen Layout. It will confirm here and just confirm it. Then check it out. As you can see, the home screen layout is changed to the default, the default factory setting. Thanks for watching. How to turn on dark mode on iPhone. How to change iPhones on light mode uh, to dark mode. Go to setting, then tap on display and brightness. And as you can see, you can choose light mode or dark, dark mode. For example, you can tap on dark mode to toggle it to dark mode. As you can see, say, uh, all the apps are now in dark mode. So, to check.
change it back to light mode you can tap on the light and let's change it back thanks for watching how to set alarms on iPhone in seconds how to set alarm in iPhone tab on clock then tab on the flash icon here then page uh, set you your preferred time, your alarm time, then if you wanted to repeat every day or every Sunday, you can't have dates that you want to repeat as alarm. If you want every day, if you want this alarm every day, you can't have on all of them. Then just back. As you can see, repeat is every day. You can add a level. Well, for example, morning. Then, uh, to edit the sound, click on radio. Then you can choose sound. And on the default one, if you want vibration, you can go to haptics and you can choose which vibration is preferred for you. Then, if you want to snooze every minute, you can turn on this one. Finally, click on save. As you can see, we have set an alarm. Thanks for watching. How to find your iPhone model, serial, and IMI number fast? How to get your iPhone's model number? Go to setting, then general. And tap on about. As you can see, as version is 17.1, model name is iPhone 13 Pro Max, model number, as, as you can see, and the serial number, everything you, about your iPhone's detail information is in this page. Thanks for watching. How to turn off the annoying iPhone keyboard sounds and to silence those clicks? How to turn off keyboard sounds in iPhone. For example, if you have uh, the default settings for your iPhone, your keyboard will sound like this. Which is sometimes annoying. So, if you wanted to silence this annoying sound, keyboard sound, you can go to setting, then send sound and haptics. I scroll down and tap on keyboard feedback. This page will find sound is on, so you can turn it off. If you want a vibration, you can turn on this haptic. Let's check that. Okay. As you can listen, there is no sound now. My keyboard is silent. Thanks for watching. iPhone keyboard shortcuts. iPhone keyboard shortcuts. So first thing is, when you want to write a capital letter, you just tap on the shift icon and you write. But in case if you want all the letters or the sentence to be capital letter, just double tap on this card. Shift icon and your sentence will be written all in capital letters. If you want to miss something and want to go back, you can tap using your finger, but you, instead you can do this. Just hold on the space and you, you can drag it. So if you want to remove J, just press back. It's also thing. Uh, you can left if you have if you want to use your keyboard with only with your uh, one of your hands. You can go to here and keyboard setting. In this page, tab on one-handed keyboard. Select left side or right side. Let's check it out as you can see. 
my keyboard is shifted to the left so I can easily use my left only level with my left hand I can reach on every key to fix this just tie on this one the other thing is um, go back to keyboard setting and tab on text replacement Re text replacement and this page uh, if you want uh, some some shortcuts you can add some shortcuts for example I want to add uh, my bank account my bank account will be something like this and my bank account I said this let's go back to our keyboard and uh, let's type the shortcut name my bank back as you can see a bank account is displayed so tab on space here is it my bank account is written so this shortcut instead of typing all this my bank account numbers I can zip it once and whenever I write my bank account it will display uh, the shortcut so uh, if you get this thing is useful make sure to like the video and as well make sure to subscribe thanks for watching how to insert sim card to iphone how to insert sim card into your iphone first go to by the side and as you can see there is a hole in the hole you need to have this pin and insert this pin into this hole and press it a little as you can see the tray is open drag it out Then put your SIM card this way. To insert it, just put it back and press it a little. Play. As you can see, the network is coming. This is how you will insert a SIM card into your iPhone. Thanks for watching. How to remove SIM card from iPhone? How to insert or remove your SIM card from iPhone? First, remove your cover. Then you need to have this kind of. Uh, uh, eject materials for injecting or inserting the iPhones and press this little uh, how or insert the pin into this hole and press it a little as you can see the sim card tree is open and here is my sim card To insert it back, just place your iPhone, uh, your SIM card to this tray, and insert it. Just for showing you, I will remove the SIM, and then we'll insert it. And I don't know, but... Thanks for watching.